This video will show you how to use Goal Seek for your gradebook project. I've got some sample data over here for us to work with. This is a gradebook example. We have quizzes, we've got four quiz grades, and then an average. We've got homework, sample homework grades, and then an average, and then projects. We've got project grades, but we're missing the last one. We have an average at the end of that, and then this is the average of all three sections. So that's an average of A7, A14, and A21. Right now our average is an 85.52. If we want to use Goal Seek to find out what we need on this last project to get an A in the course, this is how we would do it. We would go to the Data tab and choose What If Analysis, then choose Goal Seek. Our Set Cell is where we have our average, so we're going to select cell B3. We want that to change to an A grade, in this case that would be a 90. And to do that, we need to change cell A20. So what we're asking Goal Seek is, what does cell D20, excuse me, A20, have to be for our set cell B3 to be a 90? Click OK, and we see the computations occurring there. And now we see that we've got to get 142 on our final project to get an A in the course. That might not be possible. Let's see what we have to do to get a B. So, go back to the what if analysis, goal seek, our set cell, still D3. Let's see what it takes to have that set to an 80. By changing cell A20. Okay, it calculates again, and we can see that cell A20 has been changed to a 22, so we have to get at least a 22 on that last project to get an 80 in the course.